Hi guys, this is Cy from Cyanide Software. I'm just going to quickly go through where to find everything and how to set up to do our beta test on uh, three of our products. So first thing you're going to do when you get to our website is you're going to need to register because you're going to need that to log in. So simply go to the register button or press this image. It'll take you to the registration. When you fill this out, you get an email, of course, that you're going to have to click on to uh, verify that your email is correct. And then you're going to simply just go and log in. Once you're logged in, uh, just go down to our product downloads. And we have three products that we're doing a beta test on right now. So download the version that Max is, uh, is the Max that you're using. Once you've downloaded it, uh, extract it to extract it and then run it and this will give you just a quick little startup of course you'll have to go through the agreement once more <laughs> agreements uh, hit next uh, make sure it goes to the correct version of Max that you're using or where you have it installed and then when you're installed you're all set so the next thing is as soon as you fire up Max so um, you're going to need to put in your username and password and log in. And if you see this green, you're logged in correctly. If not, then your username and password is wrong. And that's just, it's the same login as the website. Uh, if you click on Remember Info, it's going to save that. If you click on Auto Log, Next time you fire up Max, you're not even going to see this. It might just pop up real quick, log in and shut down, but it'll automatically log you in. This is going to show you what licenses you have. So right now we're doing a beta test on Proxi and Cyclone. And Forensic is a free license for everybody, so you're going to have that. Uh, global settings here are for another plugin that we're just about to release. Uh, which is uh, our I, um, Ignite, which used to be uh, a, our basically our launching tool to launch all these plugins, but now we've added a lot more to it. So, uh, and there are some global settings that come with that. We gave you sort of one here, and <laughs> every modeler is a little different. Um, I prefer not to um, ever use orthographic view. So you can see that this goes in orthographic after I hit top. If I force perspective when I change, it brings me right into perspective mode. So there'll be no more orthographic view to um, the way I'm using Max. Now, if I shut that off, then it's completely back. So, but we have a lot of other um, uh, global stuff that we're adding in, and this is all part of Ignite. Once you set this, this is just, like I said, our license server. You can close this up and be done with it. Uh, for forensic, uh, you're going to need to go into our, uh, go down to configure button sets. You're going to need to scroll down and under Sinai software, you'll see forensic. Uh, uh, just drag these over to where you need them. And once you hit OK, like I said, this will open up back up Decipher. And uh, this also helps if you have, if you've lost this and it's gone completely off screen. Uh, it'll reset any of our plugins and so that's basically what config does is it just if something gets lost off the screen or opening decipher forensic is found here so uh, this is your scene checker our other tools right now are object plugins so if you go to um, go to the geometry drop down to Sinai software and you'll see Proxi uh, you'll see Cyclone and Scatter will be coming out soon. That's a different plugin of ours, but um, that'll be out for beta test in the next couple of months. So thanks a lot, guys. Have fun. And um, just to pop back to the website, um, any sort of problems that you're having, um, I encourage you to go through and one first read the facts um, about, you know, plugins or subscriptions or in general. Uh, we have a support forum, which we just started now. Uh, so just go give us some input on, you know, um, what you want to see, what problems you're having. Uh, if it's a critical issue, sorry, if it's a critical issue, uh, just create a new support ticket. 
just go in here, create a support ticket, submit that through, and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Support tickets are going to take a little longer. Forums might be better for stuff in the beta. We encourage people to please post stuff in there. Um, and I hope everything you enjoy this beta and uh, help us out I'm trying to get these things out to uh, everybody and get them in working order. <laughs> Uh, we've done quite a bit of testing, but you know, there's always something different. Um, so that's why you do a beta test, but thanks a lot guys. Cheers. Bye.